Hi, this is Thomas from Mars Moon Space TV. I am having a déjà vu here at Soul number 735. Take a look at this one. This one has been described as an alien device. An odd and artificial created artifact. Loving child has gotten many names, so does this one. This is the original picture from NASA. NASA. This is how it looks without any enhancements. This is straight from NASA's homepage. I decided to take out a few anomalies from uh, Soul 735 and let's have a look at some of the other anomalies from that day. This one is also an awesome one. Take a look at that sand. Is that something NASA had put up as an extra layer to cover up something? The way it looks on the picture you have enhanced looks to me it's suspicious and the structure that it covers looks also artificially created to me. It reminds me of one of those you put small flowers in on the balcon balcony at home, uh, <laughs> put it up and hang it out in, in the sun. Uh, I don't know what it is. I can only say what it looks like to me. And this is the raw image from NASA you are looking at right now. This is an amazing image. And this one went well right after I posted it uh, two years ago with the description writings on a rock on Mars. And I do understand why people believe or think or saying that it looks like writing because it does look like symbols on the rock laying on the Martian surface. Here is the original picture straight from NASA's homepage. This is what it looks like, and you see the object to the top left, right, sorry, top right. This is a great picture, and please share it, because I believe there is something in this picture and those symbols that are true. This is another one. This is, we are just jumping 700 souls ahead, and this is in the red box what looks like a face carved into the mountain on top of a possible body. And to the right, there is this odd shape, sh chip potato chip shaped object laying on a square rock that to me does not look very natural. Take a look at the gigapan here provided to us by my good friend Neville Thompson. This is the area we just were looking at here and we are zooming in on that potato chip, chip shaped object laying on the rock. Take a good look at that one. It does not look very natural to me. The whole area seems to be full of anomalies. And I am trying to point out the head and the position of the head and the statue that I was looking at before. We are zooming in here now and you can see it in the middle of the screen right here. Sometimes it takes a minute or two to really see what's going on in the picture. So take your time, spend a minute or two, pause the video here and take a look at it and find out and tell us what you think we could be looking at. Of course, this could be a, a trick of light uh, and just simple rocks uh, and our imagination gone wild. But with all the stuff I've seen on Mars lately, uh, I just don't think it's a trick of light. I've seen so many amazing things on, on Mars. and Yeah, that's just the way it is. Take a look at this one. That looks like some kind of an outpost where you keep an eye on what's going on in the valley behind you or below you or in front of you. It looks like there is a little housing with two square frames looking like windows and of course it's to me it's looking like windows. I'm trying to zoom in here now on the original Gigapan where I found this one on. And here you see it on top. This is a really really odd object. And the square frames that to me looks like windows does not look natural to me. This is very, very odd. I want you to show you something else. I don't have the picture by Tina made right here, but I'm going to show you on the Gigapan. Take a look at this wall. It looks like rocks are piled on top of each other in a precise layer to create a wall. I've seen almost all curiosity images, not all of them, there are thousands and thousands, but I've seen the most of them. And I've seen much of, mainly with layers uh, in this uh, rocks, uh, sand, stuff, so on and so on. But this one does somehow, you're looking at it right here, right now, I'm zooming out here, look artificial or like the leftovers of something that once was 
let's take a look at the image up here again before we end this video this is sold 1428 1429 thank you to Neville for making those gigapants and with the picture of United Family of Anomaly Hunters I'm gonna say thank you for watching my video it's been a while since I did March videos and I'm gonna be back again full time until we see you again take care bye